Hello everyone, um, in this video I want to talk about what's going on in the world at the moment and um, what you guys think of Trump because when Trump first came into power I thought oh my god this is going to be ridiculous he's one of those power hungry uh, businessmen and he's going to basically um, mess up the whole of the world okay but as he's, as he's been going um, and as I've been watching him and researching a lot of spiritual evidence for this as well he's actually doing a very good thing and um, he's actually understanding love from the next level uh, some businessmen who have it all okay they've got a lot of money a lot of power some of them get to a point where they've got so much power so much money they can do anything they want and they realize eventually that after they've had everything they want all there is that, that's left is love and I think Trump is on that level okay he understands love and he's trying to help the world he's trying to bring world peace um, if you're not a Trump supporter I understand this because you might not like the guy he is a bit of a, a crazy guy sometimes he's not afraid to say things which is a good thing in my opinion he doesn't like the fake news uh, which is an amazing thing because I cannot stand fake news I don't like how the news channels work I don't like all that manipulation he understands that and he's trying to stop that which makes the news channels not like him um, the powers that be um, who might be even above him don't like him I don't think because they, a lot of them don't want world peace because they want to control everybody they want to manipulate everyone um, but I think Trump's doing a good thing, especially for the future of our world. Um, he's trying to stop child trafficking. He's uh, he's more lenient on things that are not so um, so kind of so bad. What the other presidents did. He's never declared war on anyone. He's made peace with all these enemies that the USA and the UK and the European Union had. He's made peace with them. Um, I think all the troops are a lot happier now, the people in the army are happier. Um, yeah, he's doing a good thing, guys. And I know this sounds crazy, but the more I speak about Trump, especially to my partner as well, she, she thinks he's a good guy. Um, there's a good channel I listen to on YouTube called Beyond the Veil, and they're extremely spiritual people. They've gone um, very, very high spiritually. They've done a lot of ayahuasca. They've, um, they see like a kind of reality rather than just the new age spiritual stuff that evolved past all that and they, they they follow Trump they believe he's a good person they actually think he's uh, he's, he's he's part of an antivirus and there's a virus and he is the antivirus they go so far as to think that everything's AI and it's antivirus which it might very well be <coughs> or it might not um, we don't know for sure yet but if you listen to those guys, they're very, very interesting people. It's uh, a guy and his wife, uh, Chris Geo, he's called, and I like, I enjoy listening to their 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 shows. Um, but yeah, but a lot of people in the world are just not, they're not seeing the wiring behind the board. Okay, a lot of people are still influenced by what's in front of them um, on the screen without seeing the wiring behind the screen. Uh, an example of this would be social media for example like a lot of us or you people that watch videos like this where I talk about the awakening I talk about um, how to evolve etc um, you you guys might think that the world's fully awakening okay because whenever you go on YouTube it'll give you all these videos of new people making this awakening video this awakening video um, when you go on Google it'll give you adverts about it so, so to you it looks like the world's awakening but in reality when I've thought about this I don't think this is the case okay I think um, I think that we fooled into thinking that because all the algorithms now the way the work is whatever you search for it's gonna show you okay it's gonna keep showing you and it gives us this false sense of reality so it looks like every, everybody's awakening um, with me and my partner spoke about this the other week because um, it looks like the world's awakening but when you actually put down social media YouTube etc Facebook and you go out and actually watch people 
everybody's in different realities, okay? Everybody's in different realities, and most people you see are not awakening, it's just we think they are because the algorithm is, is, is fooling us into thinking that because that's it knows that's what we're interested in, you see? Uh, so it might, you might go on Facebook and see a group with um, 200,000 people uh, talking about the new age spiritualism stuff and things like that and you think, oh well they're starting to awaken even though new age stuff is not necessarily real but it's a stage we go through before we see reality. So these are all going through that stage. We think, oh that's a lot of people but in reality it's not a lot of people. It's hardly any, any, any amount of people and 99% of the world are most likely not awakening but we don't see that you see but when you put down your phones etc and you go out and watch people you'll see everybody's everybody's on that reality that the algorithms are showing them okay you might be sitting watching all these spiritual videos and seeing the world's awakening somebody next to you is sitting there on the phone uh, watching a football match and everybody around them's into football okay that's their reality um, somebody might be into Love Island or all these reality TV shows and all this nonsense uh, that people put on YouTube and um, that get millions and millions of views a lot more than the spiritual videos and that's their reality okay so I wouldn't necessarily trust the social media because they're very clever in the way they manipulate uh, you into, into, into keep going on because they'll show you what you're interested in all the time and this is worrying to me because it's not giving everybody a sense of reality and it's actually separating everybody, okay? It's separating us all. Uh, it's the same with this Black Lives Matter, etc. I went in a, uh, a shop here today and uh, it said it's Black History Month, something like that. And I'm thinking to myself, that, that in itself is racist, okay? Saying it's Black History Month. That's separating black people from white people. Uh, whereas our class everybody is just a spirit in a body okay everybody's exactly the same we've all got the same consciousness we've all got the same and we see the same things we've got the same five senses so all this manipulation is separating us and I think the powers that be do this on purpose because they don't want us all to come as one and that's how these social media platforms work they don't want us all to come as one and that's why when in the past on things like MySpace or, or Facebook even, you would put a story and all your friends would see it. It would get hundreds of likes, etc. Now, three or four people might see it, okay? Because they don't want any individual to have the power to put their word out there. And they're doing this very cleverly. So be mindful of that, guys. And um, and just, just, just go out in the world and just watch people. See what they're doing. Um... But don't do it in a negative way, you know, like just enjoy yourself and um, watch people if they're doing something you don't like. Just don't get angry with them. Just think, well, I'm glad I'm not doing that. And just enjoy life because it's very diverse. I think it's meant to be this way. And I think the universe is doing all this on purpose because we're going through an awakening at the moment because of this uh, lockdown, etc. A lot of people have had more time to think about things. A lot of people have had more time to awaken um, and realize there's more to life than just working, 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 etc. And this is a good thing. And uh, I think Donald Trump is doing a, an amazing job. I hope he's going to get elected again myself. Um, I hope it's not going to be rigged because, let's face it, the news channels and the other people in power don't like Donald Trump because they don't want world peace. Whereas Donald Trump's going that next level. He understands love and he's trying to bring that to the world whether you see that or not. But that's it guys, um, let us know what you think about that. And I'd like to thank you all for the comments on the last video. I know it was a little bit crazy. I was out high again and I showed you the mirror effect where everything was reflecting. Um, but I'm, I'm gonna keep going out doing this and I'm gonna put a few clips together because sometimes when I go out high, I'll only see like um, a couple of things. So it's not worth making a video, but um, don't worry, I'm not addicted to drugs or anything like that. Um, some people said it's your mind doing it, just looking at reality in a different way. Um, and that's for another video because a lot of people think there's just this baseline reality and your mind can play tricks with you. But in my eyes, the reality itself, all the physical matter is not, not uh, a baseline reality. It actually changes with your uh, psychological state. It changes as well. And uh, I'm going to make more videos to prove this. 
uh, so stay tuned for those guys and that's 10 minutes 020304678 please subscribe 10 like this video 11 12 goodbye have a nice day 15